In Creo Parametric 10.0, reorder and restructure workflows are improved to avoid unintended restructure operations. Previously, it was possible to unintentionally restructure an assembly when the intention was to reorder a component. When dragging components in the model tree in Creo 10, there is now a better indication whether the operation will result in reorder or a restructure for the drag component. To reduce unwanted expanding, a timer for automatic expansion of the tree nodes when dragging a component was prolonged. Additionally, tree nodes that are invalid for restructure are no longer automatically expanded when dragging a component over them. In case of a restructure, a new dynamic tooltip now clearly states what component is being dragged and into which component it will be restructured when dropped. This is especially useful when the target component is not in a view in the model tree. A new confirmation dialog serves as an additional precaution and asks to confirm the restructuring operation every time. The dialog is driven by a new option All and Confirm in an existing enabled drag drop on components configuration. You can always disable it if you feel that additional precaution is not needed. Visualization of the tree nodes during the drag operation was improved to ensure the component names are clearly visible and operation type is clear. Sensitivity zones were also adjusted to make the drag and drop behavior more coherent. In addition to the tooltip and the dialog, a summary in the message area was also added to inform which component was moved and where to. These usability enhancements should eliminate unintended component restructures and provide an overall better interactivity and system feedback.